Eat fast, chuckle nuts! Hello everyone, Prince here. I think fast! It is Boulder Dash 30th Anniversary Edition. Boulder Dash, a game series that apparently has been around long, just as long, if not longer, than the Mario series. But with much less titles entered into it. Anyway, before we go more, more into the game itself, options menu, it's pretty basic. It's basically, you want full screen on or off, antitropic, anti aliasing all that fun stuff. Now, when it comes to Boulder Dash, I, I want to say that I am familiar with it to an extent, but not super well. Like, I think I played the game when I was like two or something, like when it got an NES port, but I never touched it since then. But apparently it like started on the, uh, what you want to call it? It started on like Atari or the Amiga or something like that. But apparently, but then I remembered wrong that I didn't actually play Boulder Dash. The game I was remembering was the original Gauntlet. Don't ask how I made that association, but with enough screwing about aside, let's go into the actual game. Boulder Dash is a puzzle game of sorts. Where you basically you just try and dig through a cave, push rocks out of your way so you can and get to the exit. Yada yada so on and so forth. Ooh, this sounds a little wonky for me. <laughs> but the uh the whole point is that it's a puzzle game where you have to keep your you have to basically well, push rocks around. But make sure that nothing falls on top of you as you play. Like this. So every even since like the old, old, old version of the game years ago, it's it's had it's had physics. <coughs> Excuse me. The game has had physics of a sort where rocks will drop on your rocks will drop on your head and will kill you if you're not careful enough. That being said, uh. Okay, so unlock characters with special powers. Well, what if I just don't? Now what? Oh, did I just like unlock a grid movement? Run away. Oh. So if I hold the shoulder button, I can kick stuff? Apparently I can kick stuff around if I hold the shoulder button. Wasn't aware that was a thing. Uh, new hero crystals. Okay, new heroes. Cool. I guess I don't. Ca I don't care enough about that anyway. So, okay. So col keep collecting gems in a certain order, and you get bonuses. It must be same color gems, actually. Uh, d d dinamite. Ah, uh, dinamite. Apparently, I have. I don't understand how I got dynamite, but I'll I'll roll with it. New rules. New rules are scary. Okay, and you gave me. Oh, I can unlock the hero Onyx. I gotta lock heroes. Why do I want to unlock heroes? Okay. So now it's teaching me about how to play around with boulders. Also, solo from the dog. Push. Well, that's nice that you taught me how to play with boulders. Um, that's nice. Okay, I'm out of here. <laughs> So it's super simple. I mean, it's Boulder Dash. It's it's a concept that's been done time and time again. There actually was a uh, cause cause uh, Yarhar Field of the D being a pirate is already to be. 
ages ago I played Boulder Dash on... Uh, I played Boulder Dash. There was a Game Boy Advance port of Boulder Dash. Uh, bye. I'll take those gems now if you don't mind. Except now I'm stuck on the gr I'm, no, I'm stuck here with all this. You can have this. Okay, well there's the exit. Well, you can have that. Oh, that's not close enough to pop, pop it open, is it? <laughs> so how do I get more dynamite? <laughs> Well, I don't think... Well, I got enough gems to get the rank, the ranking, at least, but I want in there. Whatever. Enough to get... Enough to sate myself. I didn't find every single gem. Let's see if I can do that right. So, do I get... Oh. So, I guess I do have to get, like... Set gems. Okay, let's see. This, this, this. Apparently not that. But now I've got nothing to work with in terms of how to dig deeper. I've just... I have no dynamite. Do I have to, like, buy more dynamite? Is that what's going on here? That'd be upsetting. Okay. Let's go to worlds, because maybe that'll be, let me, oh my god, it's mobile. It's a mobile platform. <sighs> oh, I bought it. Oops. But yeah, it's mobile platform set setting. Okay, that's unfortunate. So you can buy more things, but you have to get the medals. Here, you can have that. Okay, so what does this fairy do? Explodes into many much money. Um, well, I know what to do here. Apparently I didn't need to do all that. Well, I seem to have wasted my golden opportunity. Oh god. Okay, we can be civil about this game. We can be civil. <laughs> You don't blow me up, I don't blow you up. Oh god, that was terrifying. I'm out. Alright then. Oh. I got more dynamite. Great. I don't know, it's... It is... Okay, so you can't move those kinds of bricks. Well, I know what I have to do to get through then. Oh, I could have... Oh, there was actually a solution right here. I'm smirt. See, look at me go. Look at me do the smirt. See, that I didn't have to waste my dynamite at all. So yeah, Boulder Dash... It's... I guess it's... It's... Boulder Dash was, ki was just a game that was more or less, um... You know, how much... Which I think, how quickly can you beat a level with set pieces in mind? Can you dig it? Catch, 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 catch. Ooh, it's a risk versus reward kind of game. Eh. And quick reaction timing, too. <laughs> uh. No. I'll just replay the level, you know, how a game's normally supposed to be played. To hell with this free to play model. God damn. That's actually upsetting me that it's set up in a free to play it's set up free to play, so to say. Eh. Okay, go up here. Stop chasing me. Don't chase me. I'm startled. But yeah, that's just uh like I said, I'm not... Yeah. 
I like the game. It's it's a puzzle game that's pretty fast paced. But um Oh you make it the gem. Oh but it turns certain things into bad. Um oh, Dinamite. It gave me enough for this. Okay, push that aside. So do you fall? No, but everything above you falls. Neato. Oh. Oh, I see what they're trying to do here. They're trying to trick you into remaking it rocks. Okay. Okay. Give me this. Well, I goofed at some point. Yeah, I definitely goofed. Whatever. I got enough gems to win. <laughs> Now, in terms of music, well, there isn't any, I'm noticing. There's, like, a complete lack of music. Are we done? <laughs> you won log. It's log, it's log, it's big, it's heavy, it's wood. Okay. Okay, so now I have 10 more seconds. I can find the exit, which is up there. Wow, that really snaps quick. Okay. Like, how about I just play the game? Don't, like, f don't force this free-to-play model on me. I know what I'm doing. Grow man, pay taxes. Uh, bug. Apparently I have unleashed the wrath of bug. Okay. I'm just gonna kick that in there. Kick it! Explode in happiness! Hell yeah! So there's some parasitical movement. You can tell me I'm running out of time, but I won't believe you. I'm digging. Dig it, dig it, dig, 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 dig. Good enough. I missed a gem. I missed a couple gems, whatever. It's good enough. I think one or two more levels, just so we can see what the game fully has, but I hate that it is a little... Oh, God. There goes that. I do hate that, you know, even though I kind of... I do like this series a bit. Does that break it? Oh, well, you know, it breaks it. That also breaks things. Like... I do like this game, how it's structured and whatnot, because it is, you know, through and through a puzzle game. But they just kind of sucked all the life out of it by making it look like it's a mobile game. It, it just all this. I mean, it still functions like basic Boulder Dash. But I'm still I'm still upset that it's set up in the free in a free to play format of sorts. God, I'm gonna complain about that until the end of days. Well, you game double score. Don't care about double score. See this? Me? See? See how much I care about the, the stupid double score? Run away. Okay. Okay. I suppose I have to think about how I'm going to attack that. Huh? What if I just get rid of that? Okay, I got too greedy there. No, I won't. You don't have to do that. Oh, crap. I'll figure it out. Just give me a second. Um, well, what if we do this? We wait and get out of the way, and then we come back. Oh, hey, rocks. Were you there when rock was good? Oh. Well, know what I'm doing here. Thank you. Huh, weird. The game just like... Oh. Okay, double score! Woo, double score! How long does it last? Is it like a permanent thing, or what's going on with this score thing? Okay. 
Okay. You have fun. Um, do this. Okay, I may have just locked myself in. Okay, I kind of locked myself in, but it's close enough where I can get out of here. Alright, and, you know, I think I'm going to call it good. I hate to say it, but it's, it's unfortunately kind of uninspiring in a sense. Like, it's not terrible. It's not bad. It's it's Boulder Dash. It's a it's a fast paced pu uh, puzzle score attack game. But God, I've said it like three times now. But the what is it? The the free to play model is kind of going on here, which means which means you know this game might be out on mobile. But the free to play model has got set up in a sense really does kind of feel, make it draw something away from it, when it could have been a much better game if they had just left it as is with whatever it's got going on for it as a puzzle game, but whatever, that's not my, that's not my decision to make really for you guys, that's your, that's up to your discretion if you think it's worth it. Speaking of, if you are interested in the game in Boulder Dash 30th Anniversary Edition, you can find all you can find all the information about what system it's on, how much it's going to cost you, down in the description down below. But I do want to thank you all so much for watching this episode of Think Fast, and I'll re come back next time and I'll react to a new title for the very first time. Take care, everybody.